Howdy doody everybody, my name is Kev Gooey and welcome back to the final episode, most likely, for Marvel Spider-Man Miles Morales Launch Edition. So, the last episode because we are... We are going to do the final mission to get the last suit. It's going to be awesome. And apparently there was a Danacast? Before we do that, we're going to look at the searcher feed. The Daily Bugle. Rieger arrested. Former head of R&D at Roxon Corp. Operation charged after massive leak shows widespread cover-up of the adverse health effects caused by the company's experimental energy source, Newform. We, sur we survived the storm, but our uh, margarita spilled everywhere, so I can't really say it was worth surviving. Thank God, I've been trying to get a hold of you for hours. You wouldn't answer your phone. Wait. Uh, uh, Tam Tama Tamatillo... Oh, tomato? Tomato face? Tomatello face? <laughs> and and then John John Spaghetto. <laughs> Thank God, I've been trying to get a hold of you for hours. You wouldn't answer your phone. Uh, you didn't show up for your for the party. How do you still not understand how bad the storm was? Uh, Jamison in space. Whoa, that was a bright flash over Harlem. Everyone okay down there? Stay safe if you're in Harlem, fam. Scary times these are. I'm a professor of bromance. A regular bromeo. Get with the brogram. I have a very extensive vocabulary, an expert in brotography, and I am a practitioner of broga. Um, Lee Tank. I've worked at three different offices in the last year, and without fail, my co-workers always get into the same argument. Is a burrito a sandwich? Is ravioli a dumpling? Is cereal a soup? Okay, but are two cupcakes squished together with icing in between a sandwich? Of course, that's a textbook sandwich. This is where I'd show a picture of a piece of ham between two huge biology books and say, No, this is a textbook sandwich. A-B-H-H, -H, always be having ham. You're well on your way to being the favorite daughter and maybe even the favorite child. My mother, who has one kid. <laughs> that's a that 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 that's great for uh, your the daughter's self esteem there. <laughs> I just learned that moons can have moons, so obviously now I'm browsing space telescope websites and spouting it's an existential crisis over deep field photo photographs. Uh, Spider-Man, hey, um, there's a bunch of people in purple and some in red armor duking it out in Harlem. Maybe you could do something or whatever. It's snowing a lot right now. Guess this is the storm of the century they've been warning us about. That was the best best game of hockey I have ever watched. Attention, stay away from Harlem. If you are nearby, take shelter immediately. Rock Sun in underground and active conflict. Shots fired. Scary time to be a Harlem resident. There's chaos in the streets. Just remember, we will get through this together. Heart. Good will always triumph over evil. Sending love to you all. Harlem strong. Easily Loam. The weather we are having in NYC right now is what I've been waiting for since winter started. Bruh. The storm of the century is incoming and this is what you've been waiting for? What kind of weather weirdo are you? Wow, and let me the storm. Time to find some snowflakes and hopefully not freeze my hands and feet off. Law. The flashing lights at Oscorp Science Center. Do they do raves now? <laughs> the Daily Bugle. Storm of the century. It's here. Bundle up and bend down the hatches. Plus, how to keep your children occupied if your power goes out. Roxanne Corporation, we have received numerous reports of violence erupting outside Roxanne Plaza in Harlem. We are advising our employees and nearby residents to seek shelter immediately until the area is secured. Uh, hashtag, we're, we're here for you. We're, they, they were here for you. <laughs> that, that's, that's what I'm getting <laughs> from that. 
feel like if I put as much effort into my dating profiles as I put into my dog walking profiles, I'd still be single. Guys, yeah, Spider-Man looks to strike to get the fireworks ready. We're gonna get even with that teacher who gave me an F. Hey, the trains are working again. Hey, this hey, the trains are working again. I can finally go to my job. Gracias, Spider Ombre. You're saving Harlem. Think one of those spider dudes could deliver me a pizza? Haha, <laughs> just kidding. I mean, unless. Do not try to distract the spider man with your pizza needs. Are you kidding me? Hey, it's a New Yorker's God given right to get pizza however they can. Do we actually know what Underground wants? Were they after Roxanne? So many questions. I could get this new Spidey app, but my home screen is already pretty full. So I guess I'll just have to set being robbed. Please, Shane, just get the app. It's a dangerous city. What? And have to navigate a sub menu to pull up my music? I'd rather die. Wow. This is the time for us to band together as a community, not, not cast blame. Yo, check this out. Never change NYC. Anyway, anybody heard from this first Spider Man? Is he sick or something? What is happening in Spanish Harlem? Oh, Oh, Barrio is falling apart. Uh, Spider-Man, can I borrow your web shooter? Anyone try out that new Spidey app? I hope someone robs you so I can. Uh, yeah, no, don't hope for that. But we've got two Spider-Man. Feels like the survey. Well, okay. Okay, that's it. That's the... I guess that's the uh, whole conversation. Alright, then we got... Hey, all. This cast could get a little maudlin, so... um. Instead, I'm going to phrase it as a call to action. Things are bad in Harlem. The underground, Roxxon, the Tinkerer, it's... It's all coming to a head with a neighborhood caught in the middle. City Council candidate Rio Morales is organizing a full evacuation to the Bronx. So please, if you're outside Harlem and can offer a room, a bed, a couch, anything, you could save a life. I know you're afraid. I am too. But this is our time to come together as a community. We are strong enough to survive this. Today's advice is to hold your loved ones close. Goodbye, friends, and good luck. Goodbye, friends. That sounds like you're you're going away. Sounds like it sounds like you're going bye bye. All right. We got our last mission, and I forgot to restart this thing. Oh, home. Hold on, before we go home. I'm assuming so JJJ is going to do a little podcast, so I'm kind of waiting for that. Alright, so if Peter Parker is back, um, where is he? Hey, Ma. You busy? Not too busy. What's going on? I just left Trinity Church. And I was thinking about Finn. And. Tell me about it. She saved my life and yours. Everybody's. She's the one who put us in danger in the first place. But after seeing what happened to Rick, I forget why she did it. People are messy. Take your Uncle Aaron. He's the reason Krieger's in jail. And he helped us get people out of Harlem. But every time I look at him, I think of all the pain he put your dad through. Yeah. You don't need to make a judgment on things like Nicole. Or her death. 
Just remember who she was and why you loved her. You always know what to say. <laughs> That's my job. Call me back if you need me. Yende. Si. Te quiero. All right, JJJ, where are you? I'm waiting. I'm waiting for your podcast. Where are you at? I think, yeah, I think choosing this suit for the final battle with the, uh... Man, I'm tired. With, uh, with, um, the Tinker and everything was, it was the right choice. Like, like, it, like, it just looks so awesome with the way that the, the suit just tore apart. Um, the way it did because of well with the material and all that like that was just so awesome i loved it it was just so cool i think for this final episode i think i'm gonna use the uh spider verse suit Literally waiting for JJJ to come up. To come on. Where is he? Hello? JJ? JJ? Roxanne's butt has been firmly kicked. I bet they'll be staying out of sight for a while. Good. Because I don't want to drain any more reactors. You said it, buddy. But I'm glad we were able to do this together. Me too. Until our next adventure? Which will probably be five minutes from now, right? <laughs> Deal. Oh, uh, good, good, good fourth wall breaking there. Good thing I didn't just teleport over because uh, someone's trying to steal from a feast truck. Really? Oh, it's Sue. Time to call. It's Dale, by the way. From the bodega. <laughs> hey, Dale. What's up, man? Hey, listen, Spider Man. My Spider Man, you know, my cat, took a liking to you. Oh, yeah. I like him too. Good cat. So, you know, I just wanted to say if you wanted to come by and hang out with him sometime, or like take him for a walk or a swing or something, <laughs> you know, that, that'll be okay. That's all I'm saying. For sure. I'd love to chill with him. Thanks, Tail. Oh, man, that's great. I'd love... I mean, he'd love that. <laughs> Gonna tell him now. You're a good one, Spider-Man. See you soon. <laughs> Tail's great, man. I <laughs> love that guy. Spider-Man. Huh. Actually, this suit... I don't know if uh, this suit is actually...
you enjoyed Christmas. Yeah, I think I, I think I would just uh, I can change the the daytime, right? Is that what they said? Or not. What? I guess this is the last suit that we got, so I'll just use this suit then. What's this? So that's... Jam and that's the home? Okay, so we won't go home yet. We go here. Good to see you. Been telling everyone how you saved Spider-Man. You ready to swing, Spider-Cat? You two look great. Uh. Get out there and stop some crimes, you two. I can't wait to hear what you get up to. Oh, hey, careful about hairballs. They can get nasty. Oh. Okay. up on yikes kind of a backlog after being away for a few weeks no rest for the spider-man nope speaking of which i'm not gonna be swinging behind you constantly looking over your shoulder now that i'm back i trust you and i have some stuff i should take care of like what can i help i need to find a job freelancing with the bugle was great but i'd like something steady have you thought about teaching you're pretty good at it <laughs> honestly no Hmm. No. Maybe. I'll think about it. Call you soon. Alright, anyways, let's continue on. We got one more mission here. Memory Lane. Oh, that's that's what the mission's called. Memory Lane. I walked by Roxanne Plaza the other day. <laughs> Teo's in a good mood for the first time ever. Thanks. So they, so they, so they actually do talk about the suit that I'm actually wearing. Oh, okay. I could not figure it out the whole time during this game. I thought they were just talking about, you know, my suit looks cool or something because, you know, I got default suit like in Spider-Man 1. But apparently, it, it, they do, uh, it does affect the suit wherever I'm wearing. Alright. And then you're on. After <laughs> wait. Wait, hold on. Wait. Are we just gonna leave the kitty cat? Out, out, out there. Oh. 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 Really need to sleep. Right. Sorry, I, I don't know I, would I, I don't know which music is uh which is copyrighted or not, so I I just gotta you know, make make a bunch of noise. <laughs> Of 
What? Is it? I'm locked in my room? Am I grounded? What happened? Oh, I don't have, I don't have that photo of Ben and Eric and them anymore. Is that the kitty cat? Okay, what is that, guys? What what is that food? You know what? Th this is a great time to use photo mode too. What is this food? Is that a pizza? Is that pizza or is that like baked beans mushed together? I know that's a hot dog down there. Is it? Is that a hot dog or is that a, is that a, like a really tiny, tiny baguette? <laughs> I know those are uh, potato wedges though, right next to the very, very tiny baguette, and that's a. Uh, I don't know what's on the top right. I don't know what that is. Is that, is that is that a baked potato? Because that does not look like a baked potato. I mean, it could be a baked potato with sour cream on top, but it look it literally looks like a dessert. It looks like a a a cinnamon roll. It looks it literally looks like a cinnamon roll with a lot of the 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 the, the frosting on top. That's 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 it. That's me. All right, down memory lane we go. Oh, wait, wait. Well, uh, your old TV is gone, but never forgotten. What? What? Are, what did the old TV look like? Wait, is there anything else that I can interact with? Because apparently that was one of them. What? Nothing else? What the heck? Man, I just accidentally found one thing and then apparently that's the only thing I can interact with. Except the music, but that was it. The image, the photo, their photo is gone though. Alright. Go to sleep. Just a quick nap. Alright, who falls asleep like that? With their shoes on? What kind of monster wears their shoes? The mom. It's a clue for a scavenger hunt. <gasps> a scavenger hunt? Dad and I used to do these. Did she make a new one? Natural History Museum, New York, NY. Happy birthday, Miles. Ready for the best scavenger hunt ever? Here is the first clue. Facing the park with the world on our shoulders. We guard the next clue. Oh. You mean, um, Atlas? Atlas? A Atlas, right? That's, that's, that's the guy that, that holds the uh, world on, our, on the shoulders? I'm gonna check this out. See what mom put together. Oh, never mind. Shake it out of here. Check out the Natural History Museum. Alright, so now what would this give us? What? Oh, the door is open all of a sudden. Alright, so that's the. 
I don't know that's the music. Scavenger hunt's not gonna hunt itself. Yeah, I know that, Miles. Shut up. I'm to do the I'm trying to explore. Explore. I think I'm done in the apartment. What is that? Oh my god, I, this is what photo mode is used for. Now I understand. Heartburn, gas, relief, shoes, and whatever that is. Okay, I was like, painkillers? Why, why is she using painkillers? Right, that, was, that was why I was kind of curious. City Councilwoman Rio Morales. Has a nice ring to it. Oh, the temperature's hot. Dwayne. Dwayne Reed? And like the pharmacy? Like did they just switch the ears around? Gonna need to find a new spot for our vinyl. The heck is that is that girl just wearing a very long shirt or, n or night gown? Okay. What? There's really nothing to really to, to, you know examine or whatever. Are you serious? It's nothing. What? For that one TV, that was it. Really? There's no point. That sucked. All right, let's go on this adventure. Hope the uh, kitty's okay because we just let the kitty. Haven't been to the museum in forever. I think the last time was with Finn and Dad. Those trips are really fun. It's weird to think about now. Oh, okay, so it has to be these. Okay, so okay, so they are in order because I was I was about to say like are they not in order because I kinda wanna do them in order. Spider-Man stopped the Tinkerer, Rio Morales was elected to city council, 
Roxanne Plaza is closed for good, and Simon Krieger is in jail. Boo! Ha! Bonus, I passed my citizenship test with flying colors! Still love you, China. Gonna miss your candy. Okay, back to business. In an attempt to save face, Roxanne's board released all of Krieger's personal documents. Memos, emails, real fun stuff. While I'm combing through those docs and uh, waiting to hear Triple J eat crow on air, I'll be playing unreleased, pre-recorded casts. Fresh material coming in a few weeks, and in the meantime, remember to sing to your plants while you water them. Seriously, wow. they love it. Shorter than I okay, thought. bye. See you soon. Wait. I need. I need to re-listen. I need to re-listen to that. Hey y'all, it has been a good week for Harlem. Spider-Man stopped the Tinkerer, Rio Morales was elected to city council, Roxanne Plaza is closed for good, and Simon Krieger is in jail. Boo! Ha! Bonus, I passed my citizenship test with flying yeah, okay. colors! Still love you, China. Gonna miss your candy. Okay, back to business. In an attempt to save face, Roxanne's board released all of Krieger's personal documents. Memos, emails, real fun stuff. While I'm combing through those docs and uh, waiting to hear Triple J eat crow on air, I'll be playing unreleased, pre-recorded casts. Fresh material coming in a few weeks, and in the meantime, remember to sing to your plants while you water them. Wait, she's Chinese? China? I... I did not think she was in China. You lost? Did you, did you just ask Spider-Man if I'm lost? <laughs> the squirrel. Did you just ask Spider-Man if, 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 if he's lost? <laughs> okay. Natural History Museum. Who on the postcard said, Facing the park with the world on our shoulders. We guard the next clue. Hmm. New York. This one's of the Empire State Building. I thought you top the Empire State, you'll find a pair of blind eyes. Thank you for reading. There's a flash drive attached. Hey, big man. Happy birthday. Oh my god. Dad. Scavenger hunt seemed like a fun way to celebrate 16. Tour down memory lane. Remember that summer you and Finn forced me to take you to the museum every weekend? Here's a secret. I love those trips. Used to be I felt guilty you didn't have any siblings. Things with your uncle are tough now. But I would have never made it to 18 without you. Anytime I'd see you with Finn, I'd feel less guilty. You have a sister. Her. With Finn, and now Genki, we'll always have family in your life. Love you lots, big man. See you at the next clip. Wow. I haven't heard his voice in so long. I hope he left more messages with the rest of the scavenger hunt. Hey, sleepyhead. Did you find my note? Yeah. I followed the clue and just heard dad. Did you do all this? Just the setup. Your dad made the clues last year. I know it's been tough since the move, but hearing from him could help. It does. Gracias, ma. De nada. Have fun with him. And remember, I'm here if you need me, Miles. You can tell me anything. Te quiero. Te quiero. Wait, so... So is he just gonna gloss over the, the fact that... The that is that his dad just said come on shake a leg his dad just said um you know you know if what's in in you're with finn she's you know he's a you know she he's like a sister to you so take care of her kind of thing did, did he did he just glance over that and didn't say anything because man I, after hearing that it was just like oh that's just 
that's that's heartbreak there. That just that just hurts. Cause I, I mean, he's like a sister to him, that thing, and then and now she's dead. That's pretty harsh in in that sense. I mean, he probably overlooked it because of the. I didn't even think about it because, you know, he, was, he missed his dad, so I mean, that's understandable. Listeners, oh. you all know that I pride myself on truth, integrity, and facts. I've been tough on this new Spider-Man since the disaster on Braithwaite Bridge. For good reason. The kid screwed things up so bad, even the original model would have blushed redder than his costume. Gosh. The classic one, not that ugly new thing but today i must also acknowledge that the city is rallying around this youngster and proclaiming him uh, Jeez, you're fit. a hero <sighs> with an unstable energy source on the verge of wiping harlem off the map this youthful spider man reportedly stepped in and saved life or at least that's what his supporters want us to think. The real truth is that none of this would have happened if he hadn't donned a ridiculous suit and started swinging willy-nilly around the city performing reckless acts of violence. Hero? More like zero? Ah, Jared, open up the lines. I want to hear from those who agree with me. Jared, I said open up the lines. What do you mean they're open? Well, something must be wrong. Folks, we're having technical difficulties. Please stand by. <laughs> what do you mean they're open? <laughs> oh, oh my god, that's great. Thank you, JJJ. I really needed that. I was waiting for it. Thank you. Oh. I mean they're open. Oh. Wait, where's the kitty? Uh, kitty? 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 Oh my god! Wow. I did not expect that. I did not know that could happen. Check the clue. High atop the Empire State, you'll find a pair of blind eyes. I wonder if, I wonder if doing this <laughs> helps with the <laughs> helps with the uh thing, the um the speed freak. Alright, so Empire step in so we let's go with binoculars here. Ah Just 
maybe the clues about the binoculars on the observation platform. Yeah, I, I know that's why I went down here. It's really him. Excuse me, I'm looking for. Ah. Martin Art Museum in Greenwich. I remember that place. Find the fossil hiding among the modern. Don't forget to look up. Hmm. Find the fossil hiding among the modern. Don't forget to look up. Fifth grade field trip. Empire State Building. I shall. <laughs> Never agree to wrangle a bus full of ten-year-olds, son. It took us three hours to get here, and when we did, who showed up? The webhead himself, battling vulture. As soon as we stepped off the elevator, we had to turn right back around again and evacuate. The thing I remember most, though, you wanted to stay. You told me, Spider-Man needs our help, Dad. You're a born hero, Miles. Don't ever lose that fighting spirit. See you at the next clip. Born hero. I think I learned to be a hero from watching Dad. I miss him. Especially now. Aww. Where's the kitty cat? What the heck? Does the kitty cat not like... Not part of him? To send you a message on your app. Are you ignoring me? Right. Miles, I did it. I figured it out. How to safely split an atom from the comfort of your own home? That's next on my to do list. No, speed nonagon. Collision model is updated, projectile physics is fixed, frame rate stabilized. It's awesome now. Which means I can play it? Uh, it still needs textures sound effects, music, VO. I'll write the music. We can probably do sound effects too. First, we improve and design our own spider suit. Now we build a mobile game empire. We're unstoppable. Never doubted it. I'm not doing spider things. When I get home, I'll set up a task board, start tracking out sound effects you'll need. Ooh, and sketching out a score. Yeah, woo! Can you feel that? That's me fist bumping you from afar. Later, dude. Could you like do something? <laughs> Okay. Okay. Here's the modern art museum. Find the fossil hiding among the modern. Don't forget to look up. Hmm. Museum keep a fossil on the balcony facing the river? Worth a look. It does? <sighs> oh. Next clue. Boom. Oh, uh, the heck? That. Looks like I'm going to CODBs. Where money is king, you'll find great tunes hanging among the lights. The jukebox. I had to practically drag you and Finn to the Modern Art Museum the first time you came. What do we care about splotchy paintings? But your mom and I knew. We had to show you kids that there were different ways of looking at the world. Sometimes, radically different. When I saw you two in front of that psychedelic Angela Davis portrait, heads craned up and all, I knew you got it. All that orange and gold. Don't think you ever realized the world could look that way. That you could look that way. Like royalty. Proud of you making it this far. Let's see how you do it the next one. Finn and I talked about that trip for months afterwards. Mom and Dad really knew how to inspire. Huh.
I'm security guys. <laughs> Ready? Well, CODBs, let's hunt. Hanging among the lights. Hmm. Maybe it's between the lights and that speaker. Oh. Here we go. Uh. Big lobster bills. Dad's favorite restaurant. Never. I've never seen that place before. Or heard of it. Nestled beneath Stuyvesant, lives a monster of a good meal. It's been half my youth in CODB, dear uncle. Every musician you love played at this crap little stage. Aaron even got up there once himself. Didn't do half bad, either. When he finally told me about his night job, this is where he took me. To soften the blow. But it poisoned the place for me. Never took you here because of it. Regret that. You'd love it. Just like I do. So, how about this? Find a show you want to see. Anything. My trip. Come out here and your old man will show you how I used to bust a move. <laughs> Next clue's all yours, Miles. That was gonna bring me to a show. Man. Need a minute after hearing that. Oh. Oh, I hope that I hope that I don't get copyright from that because their music, tiny bit. Yeah, I know there's a closer one. I just want to uh, see if he says anything. about some caria not while you were swinging i hope uh sorry scolding mentor mode downshifting what did you think of the article the article was great the pictures eh where did they get this peter parker guy <laughs> i'm sure mj asks herself that all the time so how was the trip did you have the pseudo while you were out there nah sable handled it like a champ her and her wild pack i mostly got to stand around taking pictures it sounds like a nice break. As much as a work trip can be. Oh, yeah. I'm feeling refreshed and ready to do some next-level Spider-Manning. And clean out the gutters at my house. <laughs> Being a homeowner is glamorous, let me tell you. Sounds like it. I'll let you go. Talk soon. Okay. Seems like each uh, postcard is uh, someone calls or someone talks to him or something happens. Nice. I love more lore. Story. Lobster bills. Holy ground for dad. Nestled beneath Stuyvesant. Lives a monster of a good meal. Pretty sure I know which monster he means. Wait, where's this monster? I didn't see no monster. Right, let's just jump down first.
Oh. Oh, here's the clue. Jeez, I know this place. The art space on the Upper East Side. No letter enters this artsy castle without stopping at the gate. Woo! Oh, lobster beans. Home away from home. Always reminded me of the Graham's kitchen down south. Took your mom here on our first date. Just about every date after that. Even once when she was pregnant with you. And she went into labor right before dessert. I blame the Cajun shrimp. She was less of a fan after that. But I'm not gonna lie, son. Some of those nights working late? Oh, yeah. I'm stopping in for some fried okra. Don't tell your mom. Mom totally knew he was stopping here. Let him have his secret. They were a good team. <laughs> oh, that's nice. Very curious, where is the kitty cat? Oh, who's, what's, who's, who's, who's that image of that girl right next to his elbow? Be around, spider kid. Mm. That whole Harlem conspiracy is wild. I really like this game telling me that I have points to spend and I, I can spend it in the game, in the, my menu, but uh, I can't because I, uh, and there's the art space okay no letter enters this artsy castle without stopping at the gate next clue nice CJ Walker Park. I know this place up in Harlem. Beneath the hoop where you learn to fly, your journey comes to an end. Man, not ready for this to be over. Aww. Middle school graduation. You and Finn joked it felt like a royal coronation when you saw the art space building. Your mom and I were so proud. Our son and our Almost daughter graduating at the top of their class. I know it made you sad, both of you, to go to different high schools. But Miles, I'll tell you, the friendships you make when you're young, the real ones, those last. You and Finn will find each other again. Maybe a few years down the line, maybe a few decades. One clue left. Bet you can't wait to get to the end. Finn and I did find each other again. Just not the way Dad thought. Yep. Hey, he thought. Voicemail. Numbers blocked. Hey, Miles. I know you're gonna hear a lot about me. Things I've done. Now that I'm serving time. I've got a plea deal, so it shouldn't be more than two years. But getting out early, it's not why I gave up Krieger told me you had to be better. And that meant looking out for other people, even if it cost you something. I don't have a lot of practice, but I'm trying. Thanks, kid, for making me a better man that I could be on my own. Take care out there. Love you, Gronk. This is it, CJ Walker Park. Beneath the hoop, where you learn to fly, your journey comes to an end. Oh, this hoop here! This is where I dunk for the first time. Here? There.
Right. Man. So many memories. And so we come to the end. CJ Walker Park. Remember when we played ball here in the summers? Your uncle showed you how to take it to Iraq. Well, I demonstrated how to throw it down with authority. Don't think I'll ever forget watching you and Finn trying to alley-oop to your mom. This place reminds me that as crazy as life gets, only one thing really matters. The people you love. You, your mom, Finn, Genki, even your uncle. Keep the folks you care about close to your heart, and you'll never go wrong. Happy birthday, big man. You are my reason for being brave. Happy birthday, Miles. Congratulations. You made it to the end. You are the reason that I'm brave. Love, Dad. Hey, Miles. What's up? Hey, Mom. Just finished a scavenger hunt. Thank you so much for putting it together. For a little while, it was like he was back. He never left me home. I love you. I love you, Ma. They're there before. Oh, I think I know that guy. Maybe. Hey! That it? Right. Just swing a bit, and see if there's any uh missing dialogue or missing uh missing uh JJJ stuff. Let's see. For like a minute or two. I got him. Permiso. Spider Man coming through. Councilwoman Rio Morales of Harlem, who has been <laughs> instrumental in the effort to scale back Roxxon's expansion plans following the revelations that they endangered New Yorkers with their highly unstable energy source, New Form. Welcome, Councilwoman. Thanks for having me, Mr. Jameson. I have to say, I was surprised when you reached out to my office. My producer, Jared, was insistent that we have you on. Something about needing to broaden our demographics, especially after your recent appearance on another much less popular show. Oh, yeah. Danica Hart was wonderful. My listeners would like to know, how do you plan to bring prosperity to your community? I think I speak for everyone when I say it's an area that has struggled for quite some time. True prosperity isn't brought in from outside by huge faceless corporations. It comes from sustained investment in the people that make our community so special. It's true that folks here have struggled, 
But that's only because they've lacked advocates in City Hall. I will be their voice. And my hope is with that support, the city and the world will see that we're a vibrant area full of brilliant artists, kind people, and now, even our very own Spider-Man. About that. You are now a publicly elected official. You are obligated to serve according to a constitution, laws, and time-tested ethical requirements, which I'm sure you respect. How can you reconcile that responsibility with your support of a vigilante who isn't bound by any of the same safeguards? Spider-Man is not our enemy. He's a New Yorker like the rest of us, and he's just trying to do what's right. And if you ask me, he couldn't be doing a better job. That doesn't replace my obligations to my community, nor anyone else's who serves in a public role. But I do sleep easier every night knowing that he's out there, helping us all pick up the slack. I'm happy to spend all day arguing why that sleep could easily become a nightmare. But we're out of time. And your approval polls are very high. So I'll just say thank you, Councilwoman. Jared will be sending you some lovely parting gifts, including my J. Jonah Java, the decaf substitute doctors like mine are insisting their patients of a certain age drink. If you down it fast, you almost believe it's real coffee. Jameson out. If you down it fast, you you can even believe it's real coffee. Oh. Listeners, you all know that I pride myself on. Hey, y'all! It has been a. Oh. Hey y'all, it has been a good week for Harlem. Spider-Man stopped the tinkerer. Rio Morales was elected to city council. Roxanne Plaza is closed for good. Oh, oh that's so we're miss so we're missing a uh so we're missing a J uh, a uh, Danicast um podcast. A billboard's been taken over by the underground. Bet there's more to it. Oh, there's a kitty. Alright, so we're actually missing a Danicast episode. Thank. Hey, Miles. MJ's flying into JFK next Tuesday. You mind covering patrol for me? No problem. She's been gone a while, huh? You must be glad she's coming back. Yeah. I'm kind of surprised Sable let her go. MJ's profile opened by calling her cold, calculating, and humorless. Lavish praise in Simcaria. They're basically BFFs now. <laughs> now that's a cool team-up. Cool and slightly frightening. Okay, hit you up Tuesday. Bye. And thanks again. Good news, friends. My sources say underground activity has subsided significantly, and the Tinker is officially presumed dead. We survived the storm of the century, and our wounds are healing. But New Yorkers must remain ever vigilant. This is the greatest city on Earth, which means there will always be lunatics trying to make a name for themselves by disrupting the tranquility of our daily lives. One minute you're washing down a delicious everything bagel with a fresh cup of Pana Fuerte coffee. The next minute, not one, but two masked menaces run by your window and you discover the hard way that scalding hot is great in the cup, but agony in your pants. Well, I for one pledge to continue rallying the public against such crises and anything worse that may yet come. After much reflection and serenity training, I am able to accept that there are now two. <coughs> two Spider-Man. Rest assured, I will continue holding them to the highest standard and will be the first to call them out when they come up short. Which they will. Often. That is my promise to you. 
And this is J. Jonah Jameson, signing off. Until next time. Okay, so from what I can tell, it, there should be 19 and then 20 for Danacast. 19 JDJ and 20 for Danacast. So let's just see, just double check that we didn't miss one. Three, two, three, four, five, six, 18, 19. All right, so 19. Okay, so we have 19 for JJJ, that's perfect. And then three, four, five, six, seven, 18. Oh, we have 18. Oh, so we have all of JJJs. Danicaz, I'm missing two, apparently. Eighteen. Nineteen. Yeah, I'm missing two. Hmm. So maybe it's something where... I feel like one of them we have to wait, maybe. Just checking in. Things all good at feast? Firing on all cylinders. Indoor plumbing truly is a modern miracle. When are you coming in to volunteer, kid? Got coffee that needs pouring. <laughs> good thing I've been practicing my form. You still got a Wednesday afternoon shift? I'm meeting up with Haley that day. Maybe we can both stop by. Ah, kid, I see how it is. Trying to look good for the ladies. I approve. Yeah, I'll keep a spot warm for you both. See you next Wednesday. See you then. We're gonna wait here just a bit and then see if it pops up, alright? Hola mijo, are you at home? I'm doing Spider-Man things. I'm still getting used to that. Reminds me of when I used to call your dad at work. Sometimes I'd catch him on patrol or he'd have to shout over sirens. You ever call when he was making a bust? One time. He was taking in a felon who'd skip bail. The guy wriggled out of his cuffs and his pants to make a break for it. Your dad had to chase him down fifth. I was on the phone for the whole thing. No way, you serious? Serious. Best part, people took pictures and it made the bugle. <laughs> Your dad was not happy. Made him the butt of a lot of jokes at the station. But, <laughs> nice one, Ma. I did not mean to do that. Either way, awesome story. So what's up, did you need something? No, I just wanted to hear your voice and make sure you're okay. I'll let you go. Bye, honey. Love you. Bye. Pete. Hey. Now that my mom knows about... You know. How much do you think I should tell her? Like, should you tell her about every cracked rib and supervillain with a vendetta? That is tough. I never had to face that question with May. I worry if I'm too open, she'll stress out. But if I hold back, she'll stress even more. I don't know. Your mom's pretty good with stress. I mean, she did go toe-to-toe -to -toe with Roxxon. Talk it out. Find out how much she wants to know. And how much you're comfortable sharing. Yeah. Yeah. That's, that's good advice. Every time I think I know everything about superheroing, bam, something new. Just wait till you gotta figure out health insurance. Let me tell you, premiums get nuts after three... Freak accident, detached redness. Something to look forward to. All right. Thanks, Pete. Take it easy. Miles, hey, do you have a basin wrench? Um, maybe in my dad's stuff. I can check. Yeah, would you? May wouldn't be happy, but I'm gonna replace the lime green guest bathroom sink. 76 was a beautiful year, but it's time to move on. Do you need any help? I'm happy to swing out to Queens. Nah, this is therapeutic. I'm doing full-scale bathroom renovation. That sounds incredibly boring. Just wait. Once you're an old, grizzled Spider-Man like me, you'll get hyped about home repair. Anyway, thanks for covering Manhattan while I'm in DIY mode. Hey, my pleasure. 
What's the point of having two Spider-Men if they don't coordinate work schedules? I heard that. All right, I should get back to it. You find that wrench, let me know. Can do. Later, Pete. Hey, y'all. I realized something today. Ooh, kind of sound like an after-school special, <laughs> but I'm going to soldier on. Okay, <clears throat> here it is. You listen to this podcast because I'm running it. You're not looking for someone more buttoned up, professional, older, with like 18 million credentials. You want to hear from and talk to me about what's happening in our city. So I won't be changing how I do things. No trying to class up the pod, no ads, no blazers. It's just me and you. And you know what? I think that's perfect. Thanks, friends. And till next time, don't become someone's reply guy on social media, okay? It's super annoying. Goodbye. One more. Missing one more. And it's that. Uh, I think it's the. Uh, uh, the uh, interview with. Uh, with the Milo's mom. Since uh, JJ talked about it. So it has to be. That one that we're missing. Yes. Love it. We're doing this guys. We're doing this. So after waiting for a bajillion hours, we got a few dialogues and one Danacast. And the one we don't have is the one that is... The one with the interview with, um... Miles' mom. Oh wait. Rio Morales interview? Oh, we already had that. Oh, my bad. Hello, friends, and welcome to the Danacast. You may have heard that I endorsed candidate Rio Morales for city council in the special election. So today, I'm interviewing her. For real. Thank you for being on, Miss Morales. Thank you for inviting me. I absolutely love your show. Aw, thanks. So you're running against the incumbent in your district. How do you think you can do better? Unlike my opponent, I live in the district, and I listen to the people who call it home. I want Harlem to be as vibrant and safe as it was while I was growing up here. Roxanne Plaza was built on the current leadership's watch. That alone should make anyone think twice about voting for him. We agree on that. Switching gears a bit, you're a full-time science teacher. What made you want to jump into politics? It's really about loving my home and wanting to fight for it. During Martin Lee's attack on City Hall, my husband gave his life to protect others. I want to honor his memory by fighting for my neighbors and friends the best way I know how. Good luck in the polls, and thank you for being on the show. Dana fans, you can join an AMA with Candidate Morales on my blog for the next hour. Until next time, remember to set one minute per hour aside for deep, meditative breathing. Helps you clear your head. Okay, bye! Oh, okay, so we actually, it seems like we actually got them all. We are right, and now off to the new game plus. Wait, wait, I want to see the new uh, stuff and new everything, so let's do this. All right. Oh, that's, that's do everything? Alright. So, there's some uh, copyright music in part of this section, etc, etc, etc. Can't skip this. So yeah, they're just gonna mute this part. I mean, 
You guys are no no already. And uh yeah. I got you. Hey, thanks. No problem. Hey, uh, you think you're gonna add that new Spider-Man too? The key? Yeah, uh, maybe. Original's just my guy, you know? Yeah, I know. Hey, is Tails Bodega around here? Yeah, bright yellow sign down the block. Can't miss it. Thanks. Beautiful work, by the way. Maybe leave a little room for the new guy. Just in case. Damn, perfect. Now we have the new suit. Box suit mod power transfer. Oh, hold on. Oh? Okay, so they aren't actually... Okay, let's just go with this then. Turn off the camouflage or really transfer a portion of the unused camouflage energy to Venom Power. Unlock Superman Power Transfer. Ready for anything. Um, spending a full venom bar to heal triggers venom shield, which lasts five seconds, blocks out damage and stun and venom stuns melee attackers. Oh, all right, let's check these. Hollow drone explosion with deactivated, knocking enemies back. Use max web shooter ammo to capacity by two. Gain venom when standing in your remote mines area of effect as it explodes, and use the gravity was area effect. Huh. And we have these. Twenty two. Twenty three. What? That's a BS. Alright, so yeah. Bye bye, uh Bam Pow Wham. Sorry. Twenty three? Oh my god, 23, 21. For these, 21. Oh my goodness, we have to have the level 21. Oh, that's the only thing I had to do. Oh my goodness gracious. Well, at least if we can, at least let's just see what the suits are like in combat, I guess. Let's see. Melee, so take down.
All right. Let's go. Hey, Pete. Headed your way. Did I miss the convoy? Not yet. They're still securing a couple inmates. Bet it feels good seeing the guys who escaped last year going back to the raft. Real good. The raft's an eyesore, but it's secure. As long as the octopus-related flaws have been fixed. Let's hope. Okay, closing in on you. Be there soon. You should let Mom know I'll be late. Miles, get cool. done. Did you get the shopping list? Hey, Mom. Uh, yeah, but uh, the bodega was out of coconut milk. Gonna check the store downtown. Oh, thank you. But avoid Midtown. That prison convoy is making traffic a nightmare. Oh, yeah. Good call. See you at dinner, Mom. Man! How does Pete do this secret identity thing? Completely stresses me out. Well, I mean, he doesn't really live at home. I think that I think that's also another thing is that he doesn't really live at home, so he doesn't really, uh, you know, as an issue. Yeah, but this this costume is literally like the other costume, okay, except be cool, be cool. Helping you know, Spider-Man protect the giant prison convoy. You can handle this. Breathe in, breathe out. Be cool. At least it, at least it doesn't look like uh, he just put on the the mask and that was it. It literally looks like he has his whole suit on, except just you know doesn't have the gloves on and stuff like that. <laughs> He's out underneath compared to freaking uh, eat. Um, Peter, in the last, uh, in the first game, where it literally just, it just looks, it's just like cut off to here, <laughs> like a, just a mask, <laughs> like a bargain basement. Pete, you here? Just down in some rocket fuel. How are you drinking? Very, very carefully. Man, you can't, can't skip no these. Helix 2 on route with heavy payload. Copy, Helix 2. We've got you on scope. This is a big operation. It's gotta be. Hundreds of felons escaped from the raft last year. Now it's time to move them back in. Police aren't taking any chances. Especially not with our guest of honor. Getting a lot of interference here. One of those guys who helped Doc Gock is in there? I think so. Could be Vulture, could be Scorpion, could be someone bigger. Okay, we got a problem. Hold back, Miles. Let me take. I got this, Pete. Don't worry. Oh, no! <laughs> it's secure. Whoa. You're tripping Helix 2. No. We have a weight in balance. Correction 2, 3, 6. Ah. Rudder's unresponsive. Freeze for impact! Helix 2, going down! Helix 2 is going down! Freeze, freeze, freeze! Helix 2 is down. No casualties. Payload compromised. Response team dispatched. Sit tight, Helix 2. Peter, I'm sorry, man. I, I didn't mean to. It's okay. We got this. Just need to contain it before... Before that happens. Hello, tiny spiders. Yeah. 
Can I change the settings of the, the game's uh, thing? Um, OT? Oh! Nearly almost contained. Can't let me down. I need to get this under control. Great arm. You ever pitch? Seriously, you're triple A easy. Hold your career. Just wait for it. Never like that guy with a straight Spider Man. Honestly. Kind of terrifying. Christmas in New York. Love this town. Never see the big guy up close. Wow. He's a work of art, all right. Not the phrase I use. Lexi, favorite holiday music. Wow, that's tough. Ooh, that is tough. Oh, why not? How do I skip? Um, as you can't. Coconut milk. Still trying to find it. Been kind of uh, an 
adventure. Are you running? Yeah, uh, sorry. I'm trying to catch a train. Mira, mijo. No seas mentiros. Grab the milk and hurry home, please. Sí, ma. Te quiero mucho. Yo también te quiero. Now we're never miles. We gotta stop him. On my way. We gotta bring him down fast. Yeah, yeah, what do we do? Let us raise temperature. Oh, mad, mad, very bad. <laughs> Are you okay? No. Oh, no, no, no! I'm okay. I've got him. Headed your way. Be ready. Okay. Yeah. Might, uh, need a minute. <clears throat> Alright, I just wanna go faster. Spider Man, you good? So weird. At least it looks better though. It man. doesn't look like it's just a mask, like I said. How did you do? This spider man is broken. Yo, W keys. Like to Welcome to the you. stream. This one will do. And skip this. Miles, get out of here. Bro. Back? The hell? What was that? Brooklyn Vision Academy. You're not going to keep pushing people around, Alexi. <laughs> My friends, I will come after you. I'm not gonna let you hurt anyone else. I am excited to see you try. Small one. You destroyed half the city. Don't you care? Yeah, this, uh, yeah, the first scene, I, I still, yeah, the first scene and the last scene, yeah, is probably the best fighting. Yeah, I think it's the best, I just love it, like, the, the, the quality of it is, is just, it's awesome, I love it. 
That's it, right? Let's see the Venom Jump, Venom Punch, Venom Ash, Venom Blast, Venom. Wait, did I do this? Wait, huh? What? That's that? That's th that's. Those are some two weird buttons I got pressed. What the heck? I don't see what it looks like actually. Okay. You've hurt a lot of people today, Alexi. Oh, Too well, late. I mean, it doesn't help with, you know, Rhino, but sure. I don't see what. Wait, hold on. What kind of question is that? You alive? <laughs> what, do you expect them to, to not answer you? <laughs> you alive? Pete, I'm asking you, are you alive? Wow, just... <laughs> wow. Simon Krieger, head of R&D at Roxxon Energy. Pleasure to meet you. You too. Uh, sorry. I think our ball landed in your yard. No. You actually did us a favor. We uh, just bought the place. Uh, we're planning to tear it down for a build. But, uh, looks like you beat us to it. I wanted to thank you. Both of you. Taking down Rhino? Solo? <laughs> you are going places, bud. Thanks. But he he's still dangerous. Nah, uh, we'll hold him for the police. You know, I always think these super troopers are overkill until something like this happens. Oh, duty calls. Hey, uh, really great to meet you both. <laughs> Future's looking bright. Hello. Hey. He's right. Yeah. Let's clear out. Let the police do their job. Just... Yeah. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Overall, Bio electricity. Wow. Gotta be honest, a little jealous. Hey, look, I got nothing on the OG. Okay, so I was right. Yeah, it's not just the helmet. He has his whole analysis. suit on underneath. Oh, man. Yeah, sorry. I've been meaning to tell you. I'm Hello, not gonna be well, around for weird. the next few weeks. I'm Holland, now Tom well, Holland. Kind of joke I'm get. Holland, now Tom Holland. No. Yeah, I know I did this already. The reason is I'm doing it is because. This is the deal. This is the new game plus suit. This. This is the new game plus suit. All right. 
And then we got this, we got the, we, and then some reason we got it stupid, unlocked the 20, level 23 and the level whatever, but bajillion. 23, like are you serious? 23. And then this is 21, and then there, then, then the skills is not even unlocked until you get to 23. It's like, are you serious? 23. Come on. And then, and then the one that I wanted to look at is this one, but it's freaking 23. Perfect dot, blah, 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 blah. Oh. Uh, oh, yeah, no, never mind. <laughs> I, I forgot that the uh, that I muted the audio because <laughs> this is co this is copyrighted music. It's still copyrighted music. Oh, someone actually said Happy Hanukkah in in the game. It's always um, it's always Merry Christmas a lot of the times, and I've never really heard them say Happy Hanukkah. Are you, are you finally done copyrighted music? Nope, still going. Oh my gosh, still going! Please, ch please change. Oh, cool. I don't care about this. I want to use the, the I want to use the, the the new game plus one. Look at this. The, at at least this one does like I said, right? That doesn't look like the bargain basement Spider Man where in where Peter Parker in in Spider Man one literally wore it like like a mask. There's there's no uh, there's no rest that goes into the body. Like this, like the head part. See it? Remember, he was just like, you know, it was just you just put it on and he wore a short sleeve shirt. Like, come on. <laughs> this is only half of the present. Well, what's the other half? I'll let you know when I find it. Welcome to Just the Facts with me. Your truth-slinging host with the most, J. Jonah Jameson. What? This Pete said it suits the autoplay Jameson show? All right, so. I am not going to play through everything. I, I thought everything would have been just unlocked for me, you know, like level 20 because level 20 was the max in the, in the, in well, the regular game, right? And apparently, no, it's not. Apparently, there's more levels. And I have to unlock it. Which sucks. It's, it's not an incentive to play a new game. This, 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 this is my thoughts on the game, all right? This, this is my thoughts on the game right now. So, as the, I guess the ending, I guess of the, the series of Miles Morales, of uh, Spider Marvel's, Marvel's Spider-Man Miles Morales uh, launch edition, this is my thoughts on the game. So, the new game plus stuff, like, I don't know much about how the development of this game went all right that to be honest i don't know all right so anything i say about that the the, the uh, uh anything i say about this game you know uh may or may not you know conflict with how the pro the uh game um development process went because i i didn't look i didn't look into it but so For the one, okay, number one, having skills, gadgets, skills, gadgets, um, suits, 
all, all that stuff with upgrades um with new game plus needed to unlock to get is not really an incentive at all to to for replay value like i understand that this game isn't as long as the first spider-man game because the first spider-man game was long a lot of suits it's awesome and just because you put the new game plus needed for some items like 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 this suit which isn't great because it's just like the other one peter parker except you know at least it's better but it's still like it's like an easter egg suit it's not really a suit that i would just decide to just oh this is the suit i want to i will wear a lot no not really i understand it's an easter egg suit but like come on like this skill here it takes level 23 like when it says new game plus like I, I expect that when i get into the new game plus stuff that this like this would be unlockable and i could just buy it so i could just test it out so i can just use it not have to go through another like few portions of the game just to be able to unlock it because to get to that level sure i'm close to that level but li literally it's just like that's not an incentive it's like are you are you serious i had to play through this again just because or really you know part of the game again just because i have to unlock it to see how it is I understand that you know some people do enjoy this game or the the playability or or you know that stuff but the repair the replayability comes from enjoying the game and unlocking stuff along the way and being able to use all the powers and everything right but then but then when you see that the new game plus is required and then you start the new game plus expecting to be able to unlock it instantly it's there it's like another wall that just comes up it it, it really it really de-incentivizes you to continue playing the game when when you know, you expect that it's already going to be unlocked and you can use it. That's, that's, that's annoying. That's really annoying. Uh, one for me. That's, so that's one, two. I think. There isn't a lot of resources to get. Again, there isn't a lot of resources to get. I mean, look at, look at it. Look. Those are the only two resources. Those, come on, like. The first game had four or five, and it was a lot. And you needed those resources, and then doing the bonus challenges for the hideouts and stuff like that, like that were actually necessary because. Um, because a lot of times the, the crimes that pop up in this game you know quite a bit they didn't pop up they didn't pop up that much um in the first game but you know but they also were crim were crime tokens all right those are crime tokens and they're different compared to like the hideout tokens and stuff like that but this if a, this this type of resource here the the gold one like that literally is like the one for all token like the all-purpose token which is kind of annoying because you then technically don't even need to even do the bonus challenges at all because you can just because when you when you because you could just um redo the uh crimes on the app and they get the coins that way tokens resources and you know etc so yeah it's just 
why are there two tokens that's it like that, there should be more and um and uh a lot of the puzzles and stuff it, they're not really puzzles i mean i kind know of, but not really i mean the the uh the postcard one you can just i mean it's literally you can just yes you can literally press the button and he'll be like oh it's over here it's over there it's over there it not that great um uh compared to the i mean the first puzzle with the uh pipe dream and then the was it the pipe dream and then the uh uh, DNA sequencing one like at least those were kind of puzzles and then um yeah and then and then uh taking pictures which is how you got this suit right here yeah taking the uh, the hidden pictures by by the way the hidden pictures you get this suit not new game plus which again this that's why this is more more like an easter egg again so yeah so and then um and then the finding the audio thing i mean that is that was was kind of like a puzzle but uh it, it's literally it's literally just um i mean more or less try and error to look I mean, you can see that for the uh, the uh, DNA genome thing as well, but um, I mean, it's not exactly as it gets harder and harder. It's really hard to, uh, you know, it's not that easy to just do trying to every, every time, right? But um, yeah, I mean that that puzzle was easy. The this uh, the and like sign missions were. More or less nice and all, but like, like all the side missions literally were to just give you a suit. There wasn't. There wasn't really anything that really. I don't know. I don't know what I expect from the side missions, to be honest, but I mean. I mean, like, in the first game, there wasn't... There were side missions, but, like, there wasn't a lot of side missions that gave suits. I mean, what, the only side mission I can remember that gave suits on, on the top of my head was uh, was Black Cat's um, side mission. Um, in, the in, the, in the main game, not DLC. In the main game where you, you know, find their hidden stash, and then, you know, find their hidden stash, and then you find the suit. Right, that was the only time I remember you get an extra suit. You find a suit for from the side mission, but that's about it. But I, I don't. And then yeah, and so in this one, you just kind of found, just got suits, just because it was at the end of the reward for the side mission. That's it. It's just I don't know. Um. And uh, three, I think three. We're on three now. Was there? Are we on three? Whatever. Um, next one. It feels like a lot of the budget went into graphics and performance, or well, mostly graphics. It seems because there's the ray tracing, there's the other graphical stuff, there's everything. Because I'm using the uh, alternative sixty FPS one. Um, you know, which has some of the ray tracing, but like, it's just, it just seems like that, that's what they did was, was a lot of it went into the graphics and the, the graphical and the, the, the performance, uh, when I say performance, I, I mean, um, I mean, they, they had to balance that out because, you know, with the, either the graphics or the performance or kind of in between, but not really. Kind of thing with the 60 fps so yeah that's why i kind of put them together graphics and performance 
But yeah, and, and then the story, there wasn't a lot of twists and turns of the story, all right? There wasn't a lot of twists and turns, all right? What I mean by that is... What I mean by that is that the... the Spider-Man 1 had a lot of twists and turns. You didn't know Doc Ock was going to, you know become the bad guy to you know to to just to more or less wreak havoc because of Osborne you know that kind of thing where he became a bad guy with like in the middle of the the game kind of thing and then there's tombstone there were other bad guys and stuff like that like I mean sure there's kingpin at one point uh, that was it and sure we have a teaser with harry osborne soon in the next game probably but that was about it that was it there's no extra bad guys literally i i expected like enemy like more enemies more bad guys that, that would appear um but there wasn't like 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 okay example is that like me i don't know anything about this game when i first played it i did not know anything right i had media blackout i had everything like uh ignored avoided everything so when i played when i started this game you know i saw rhino and then i saw tinker and then and then in my mind like i was hoping to see like i was, I was trying to catch up with who, who else will appear? Who else will come in and, you know, go against Miles Morales? No one. No one came in. And King Bing doesn't really count, alright? King It was just a time mission kind of thing, but it wasn't really anything of importance at all. I mean, unless he's somehow, you know, gonna do something to his mom in the future or something in the next game because he did threaten him so i mean that's the only thing i can think of but literally kingman did nothing he was on the computer right just it's just like me right here and then talking to you kind of thing it's just it wasn't great so and then you don't get to fight him and yeah so so yeah so literally the whole time i kept hoping that there's new enemies that would come and fight and everything like that that you would fight because spider-man 1 you had uh you had scorpion you had vulture you had uh, electro you had uh, scorpion electro you know mr negative doc Ock, you know rhino you know the, yeah the, like, a lot of bad guys to fight this one just had tinker and then rocks on goons which were pretty much stable in in the first game so it's just like except the red <laughs> except the, the except rocks on so people are, are wear red armor instead of white about it that's the only thing that that changes um and it's annoying to get the the, the combo up because of their stupid ground attack that does the stupid stun on you that really sucks because is it's three and then if you get caught in the middle you have to jump over everything or when you don't you you just lose that multiplier uh multiplier uh combo and then and then you, you don't get the the achievements the 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 freaking benchmarks where freaking doing this is is so Oh, for some reason. Hmm. But yeah, so, I mean... That, that was the annoying part, too. It's just that... Yeah. Um... And then last but not least, I guess, would be the bugs I found. Like, come on. Like... it's a, It's been a year since this game came out, right? How did I find bugs? Like, so the first bug is that weird invisible wall that was there for no reason. Like, why was that wall there? 
why why wasn't it taken now did no one find it what happened what was it put on with that wall Right, the one next to the door. What? Why was that there? I could go. I could hide behind it. I could go on top of it. I don't know. Just there. Uh, number two was the invisible lady at the uh, Oscorp um, Oscorp flat thing where you, the magnetic flat thing where you can uh, make shapes into you know that tower and then you know that thing like it was invisible for some reason why i don't know try a bug the third one is the big bug was <laughs> was uh uh ben getting stuck on one step of the with the uh, stairs one step on the second set of stairs one step that's it that that's all it took and then she was stuck there she couldn't move and then miles literally talked to himself like, talked to himself like he was a crazy person or talking to a ghost or talking to something that's not there it was really weird and i don't know how people how people missed that or didn't report it or whatever i do not know so that was the other thing um that was annoying i mean not annoying but it was just a bug and then it crashed but i mean i mean that was my fault but yeah but come on it's been a year no one reported any of this stuff okay but i guess now for the good stuff i guess the the, the good points i guess is that the the combat is pretty great i enjoyed the combat a lot more compared to one it felt this like this game's combat mechanics gameplay improved upon the first game i that's what i enjoyed i liked it it was really fun it was really good the uh um the the tricks you can do in the air now there's a bunch of tricks you can do you can do whatever but it's much easier to do it now which is great because it was kind of annoying before but i mean now i'm doing it actually gives you a lot more points and and more so incentive to do the tricks as well so yeah that's that's good um well yeah the the graphics and the the uh, performance yeah again was improved a lot i like that i really do did like it because um when i first started uh the game when i first started the spider-man one game i was on my day one ps4 which only caps at 30 fps which is horrible to play it all the time but you know with the ps5 now i was able to play it on the you know best performance you know with the highest uh fps and uh 60 frames kind of thing like it was great i loved it i loved being able to play uh yeah um this game is 60 fps with a bit of the ray tracing and all that the alternative 60 fps performance one that um i liked it i enjoyed it i really I, I liked it um and uh i think that's where they put a lot of the money into assuming okay again i'm assuming i um i don't know but but yeah so and i mean this is also on the ps5 so i mean i don't know if there's a big difference with the ps4 pro with the performance and everything there i mean i mean most likely there is but i i can't tell because i can't test it out because to have the the norm the a1 ps4 which is 30 frames so it does i didn't know i don't know um yeah so again the combat was good the graphics was great with um and the the atmosphere that the game gave during uh the during important moments of the game was great because you it felt you felt um you felt like a part of the story you felt a part of of this world that we're that you're in and it was it was phenomenal and 
in the in uh, some in, in the important parts uh example would be the the fight with the the last fight with um Tinker. like that was great it was really wonderful it was so good i liked it a lot and um and uh yeah I, and like i said this the the beginning scene with rhino was also really good um because of uh because of how um how how amateurish um miles was in the beginning like he, he was kind of cocky right he was kind of cocky and arrogant in a way where he was like i can do it because i'm spider-man i can do this now because i'm spider-man kind of thing but then you know as, as the story progressed you know the character grew up and that was awesome that was, that was great seeing the character development and all that i liked it i really loved it um because you you kind of you you can see that he started he starts to learn the importance of himself and what he can do and what to do in situations uh you know as the game progressed on um And I think that's it for more or less. No, 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 that's not it. The gadgets. I don't know the gadgets. The gadgets, it didn't seem like there was really an incentive to use them. I don't know why, like, maybe that's just me. I don't, I didn't like it. I, I, there was a lot of gadgets first of all but other than that it just i don't know like it just it was underwhelming i think that was it it just felt underwhelming when you played the first spider-man there's a bunch of gadgets then you come to this game there's four and then and then last skill upgrade is beyond a new game plus come on, like come on like if there's a new game plus at least have a new item or new gadgets you know, you know to be able to use when you new game plus like i don't know like i don't know it's, it's just i don't know I, maybe it's just me i just didn't like using the gadgets that much um i guess another thing is the suits all right like look at the suits there's not a lot of suits all right in the first game there's a bunch of suits like a lot lot more suits there's like three times more suits than this and like and like these two look similar to each other this one see this one looks it's just the reskin of this one more or less and then you know there's there's uh this suit which you know is like this suit Uh, yeah i mean this suit is just this suit but with the, the backpack and the and the uh the, the school emblem like, like a lot of it wasn't unique suits and then these two were like the same except one's yellow one's green and just I mean, sure, this, the design's a bit different. Like, as you can tell, the design's a bit different. But it literally looks... It's... It, in, in a way, it feels the same. And it's just... I don't know. It doesn't feel like there was a lot of effort in the... The, the, the style light, The style of the, the suits. Like, it just didn't... Feel great. But again, that's just me, so it's just, yeah. But overall, I enjoyed the game myself. I, I enjoyed the game. It was fun. And I liked it. Um, so yeah, so let me know what you guys thought of the game. Uh, and the whole um, series and the, you know, and uh, everything. Let me know down in the comments. And uh, 
let me know if you actually enjoyed the game or if you think the game could be improved and let me know how as well because i think i said my piece of things that need that could be changed but um or or improved on in, in the next game but uh who knows um but yeah so i hope you guys enjoyed this series this whole playlist this whole game of marvel spider-man miles morales and if you guys enjoyed it then please smash that like button subscribe down below for more awesome videos and we get to ring that little bell again for some of my uploads thank you everyone for watching this video and the whole series of this game and i will see you all in the next one Bye. -bye.